Welcome back. Welcome back all the cryptocurrencies, precious metals. Welcome back to the show. Now we are going to study everything. Uh, we are going to check now the price of Bitcoin, gold and silver right now. Let me move myself here. And let's go. What is happening now? A lot of stuff here going on with Bitcoin, with silver. And I have prepared a few charts and trying to make decide my mind. And the correction in Bitcoin was around 72% from highs using this this area here. And the correction was even stronger in the past between 2017 and and the area of 2018 so there is still risk that we are going to see lower prices for bitcoin the target that is showing you is a specific level which is 17150 in an area that bitcoin loves and it proves to be a resistant way in the past. If you check here, let me go all the way to that level. It shows up the same level here of resistance in lower time. So this this risk here on 17. So the potential for Bitcoin going there and stops or crash. There is a new level right there. And let me show you here that. I do on these all levels and the risk is still high. If you check, this is the log scale chart for Bitcoin. Uh, I started to look at the South Sea company log scale, but not perfect. So if we fail the 17, 18 area, which is now in target for October, and there is a real hitting there there are too much hitting the fund material out there in the markets we have explosion coming for the interest rates we have the news from the Vatican we cover that and you will see right here right here oh sorry right right there right there as soon as it should be okay um you will see the news that the Vatican was calling all the money and the Bitcoin can stand nothing in the past and the risk is we go lower but I don't know if it's, this is a bubble and it will crash and burn but it's very risky and the risky was August and September Bitcoin is still holding maybe I'm wrong for a month but the risk is still out there for Bitcoin so far is holding right there so I try to make my mind so what's going on here um, I use the price of crude oil we have one two three four consecutive monthly charts as a risk on a risk on potential for risk of potential here and um, every time we have this area level which is 18, 18, 75, 74, sorry, the price of crude oil will crash all the way back to 70, 70. That this different area here. So the risk who is giving between gold, silver, cryptocurrencies and crude oil, I'm starting to see this is a level that crude oil loves too much in the past. Right to the cent. You see here you see here the, the candle of last month you will see sorry I move it 1874 well, let's let's keep it there you will see that the crude oil is what is sending the signal that there is a risk of environment and uh, you will see that this is the Fed fund rate which is looks quite bullish because it's historical rate for the Fed fund rates every time we were around this level there was an explosion all the way back to four or five percent 
So the, the odds are that we may see an explosion, additional explosion for the interest rates and that's the problem with the there's no much history but it's starting to show bullish again like we may see an explosion in the interest rates above the 3.8 percent that the market is discounting so we have the price of gold that is looks weak but it is giving no signal that it will go below 1775 no signal at all maybe a test but there is no signal quite there of a massive massive uh, this is going to cross that level so crude oil is what is giving the signal and is sending signal that we may be going down a risk off plus the fed fund rates if bitcoin continues to go down like in the past it has the worst correction about 80 percent we are 72 so we have a risk of five seven percent and i believe bitcoin could go if she, it has to continue all the way back to 17 17 100 17 100 i see that the risk that's the risk for bitcoin and the time is running and um, what is going on with silver is the price of silver it's an old area it went all the way back to the even though we have massive inflation it it entered this long-term resistant area that i draw in the past i, I was i was drawing in the past and it entered right there so it, it as as gold you have the range the range here the level 16 all the way to 16 the worst case scenario and you also have the euro usd also going down and it could go all the way down to 90 cents in that case so we have the risk of potential um hitting the farm material in the environment with the interest rates going to continue going higher the charts canceling the risk on game or the inflation hedge game crude oil with one two three four negative bearish candles in the monthly charts and it really is too much material in the air for a bad october and um going back to bitcoin the area now if we fail we've been warning in the past that we started to look like a death of bubble pattern and it was giving a time frame of august september maybe one more month and i don't see i don't see that this pattern could continue with three months uh, that's too much for me but maybe i'm wrong and i believe that bitcoin has too much pressure in the environment to continue here and so far if we make it zoom here and uh, let's see here in the daily it has been be, uh, lots of the day going down and staying there like waiting going nowhere so the risk is still quite bearish but it's, it's stable now but there is potential for going down additional seven percent in my case so that's it that's the update uh in my case i believe there's going to be in better if you stay neutral and don't wait for a signal of the ranges and let's go back to the ranges 17 for bitcoin this level here which is the lows around 18 sorry this level here 1850 18 this area here and the risk for bitcoin going to 17 100 is the, is the main problem here uh, let's go all the way to silver silver looks a bit oversold oversold but it could go all the way back to this area which is a real target 17 7 16 64 sorry that's the area here and it will, i hope a soft landing for silver around here crude oil 77 it's like gravity for crude oil down 
and the if crudo goes below 85 60 that level then it's off all the way down that would be crude oil is giving the signal that if we go much a bit much a bit lower uh, to this level and we cross it in the this level here 1874 the level here the lows of the previous candle 1874 which crude oil tends to love a lot this area here and we correct much lower so that's what I expecting for crude oil precious metal and Bitcoin there is still a risk of bias signal for me you should respect this movement in crude oil canceling on the risk on all the inflation fears thank you very much bye bye